Hello, I hope you're well. Welcome to another reading. Let's see what we've got going on today. Woo. Oh, we've got a trickster energy here. Somebody tricking you out of money, a scam around you. Be careful. Something that's going to cause, uh, this could be love because, or family or uh, something with an emotional component because there's a lot of water here. Somebody juggling balls. Uh, oh, oh. We've got somebody with at least three relationships on the go. This may be somebody else or it could be collective. Uh, I don't know. But being caught out, I'm hearing. The call. Ah. Well, this is a telephone call. Somebody's being called by a trickster. Somebody's got trickster energy around them getting a message that's a trick that could put you into an emotional state. Somebody who can start a fire and walk away, make you angry, um, press your buttons, shall we say. Possibly a neighbour. Something to do with neighbours. Neighbours are watching you. Neighbours are aware of something going on. This nosy neighbour. Very nosy neighbour, I heard. A little bit of a stalker. Um, something at midnight? Watching at midnight? Some Needing to do something by midnight? That's really weird because tonight, <laughs> if you want a personal reading with me, you have to um, have booked uh, by 12, uh, you know, midnight tonight, Friday. But that's odd. Um, midnight. Something coming in at midnight. The midnight hour is close at hand. That's from the, um, that's Vincent Price on um, Thriller. Somebody going to a Halloween party? I don't know. Watching something horror. I mean, this is Gremlins. Gremlins changed into something. It's almost like... Um, at midnight, somebody changes into something. You may change into um, an angry rage when this trickster calls you. Um, and this is something that they do regularly. Somebody who presses your buttons knows exactly what to say to do. Could be narcissistic energy. Something to do with the neighbour watching. Gathering information. The call. Or a neighbour has seen somebody trying to break in and is giving you a call. I'm getting as well for someone at midnight. Something at midnight. Ooh. Oh, right. Okay. So they are showing me something I saw on a slapped ham video. Um, I just heard knocky door neighbour as well, which is an old game that was played. Something coming to the door midnight. Um, and your camera is going to record it. Could be a ghost figure. It could be somebody annoying. Somebody, somebody who's leaving something on your um, step outside or doing, and it could be nasty. Oh, I don't. Uh, there's something nasty going on, um, and it's a neighbour. They want. They wait to see you come to the door and react. They ring the doorbell. They do leave something. They ring the doorbell and they go away, and they're watching. Phyllis, a partridge game. Phyllis Partridge. Phyllis. Somebody doing something, knocking on the door, running away. There's kids doing that to somebody. There's definitely a trickster energy. Doing something. Uh, we've got hunger here as well. Hungering for something. Hungering for a thrill. I don't know, but it's something happening at midnight. Ice. Something comes out of the ice. Something that was in the freezer, maybe speaking to someone again. Somebody feeling like they've been put on ice. They have. Um, escaping. This could be um, stagnant energy. 
being frozen, escaping that stagnant could be to do with finances, seeing the way out, finding the way out, researching the way out. Feeling like you're in a stagnant energy, nothing's happening because we've got hunger, ice and escape, but you are escaping. The other side. Seeing the other side of things, getting to the other side. But beware the twixter energy. It's a job interview coming up. Two more of these. Definitely somebody watching though. Grief. There's definitely somebody around you who wants to give you grief, make themselves a noise. They're jealous, not liking where you are. Bandy, bandy, bandido, bandy. That's what I'm getting. I was dance, dancing around you. Um, yeah, somebody's telling you they're going to do something and they dance around it. They, um, they cause a lot of grief. They, um, they put doubt in your head. They, they know how to access um, you, basically. They put doubt in your head. This could be a friend telling you that your partner is um, doing something behind your back, causing grief, causing seeds of doubt, causing arguments. They want something out of that. They could even like you, never mind um, him, her, you know. They could like you, and it doesn't matter if your partner's male, female, or whatever. Okay, and you're male, female, or whatever. Um, but there's definitely a stagnant energy escaping, or somebody believes they're escaping a stagnant energy, but it could be a trick. But there's definitely somebody escaping, going to the other side, and maybe realizing the grass is not as green as they thought on the other side. Flight. Getting away from something. Being led out. Led out. Led. Led away from this hunger and this pain. I just feel, got a feeling like, oh, I don't want to do this. I don't know what. That's about feeling uncomfortable, knowing what the answer is, but not wanting to do it, wanting to stay in the comfort zone, not admitting that you want to stay in the comfort zone of feeling uncomfortable because you, you've you lost the confidence to do this. There's definitely somebody wearing a mask around you. You may be wearing a mask. Um, you may, it may be your ego that's leading the way here. Um, dancing around something. Hmm. Okay, let's see what we can get with these. Jo Joanne. I keep that Joanne. Joan. Joanne. Joan. Joan. Joan and Phyllis. Phyllis and Joan. There's a transformation coming in. It's coming in with a call. You may be receiving a call at midnight. Midnight caller. Are you a DJ? You're on the radio. Do you remember the programme, Midnight Caller? I can't remember his name, but I can see him as clear as day. Midnight Caller, didn't he solve crimes? Something like that. Sorry, my camera's off a little bit. Some maybe off centre to you. And I, I just had to do that. There may be something off centre that you've picked up on. You wonder if you're being tricked or not. All right, there's a co definitely a communication. There's a confirmation. Is it at midnight? Yes. Or after. And we've got that ringing on the doorbell. I keep getting knock knocking on heaven's door, but it's not about anybody passing on. No. Um, knocking. Somebody knocking to get your attention. This could be spirit. This could be spirit. Uh, a communication from spirit. I've got a little purple purple lights um i'm putting my um world predictions video out tonight and as i started there was an orb and when i watched it back there was another one behind me before i even got going there were flashing lights that happened twice as well so i don't know it could be somebody's trying to get your attention 
something about the Beatles. I'm seeing John Lennon. I'm seeing Paul McCartney. Um, way away, but something to do with the guitar. Making music, doing something with music. Why aren't you doing something with music? Writing about music, writing music, composing music. Film star pops up. You could be composing a film score or something. I'm not sure. They're urging you to get on with it. Maybe you're up at midnight doing that. It's almost like some, you know, like classics with a piano ding, ding, and then writing down. It's a reflection. It's something about your life. They want you to pour more emotion into it. But there's, there's inspiration. John Lennon and Paul McCartney may have been an inspiration. The Beatles, some of their songs. And I'm getting the song, help, I need somebody, help, not just anybody. Help. That's my favourite Beatles song, by the way. When I was younger and younger than I am today. I never needed anybody's help in any way. But now those days have gone, I'm not so self-assured. I've opened up the door. Okay, so this could be... Um, I've opened up the door to somebody or you're being asked to open up the door to somebody. There could have been something in the past, grudge, whatever, something in the past. Um, you're being asked to open the door. Um, not that with a person who's leaving things, but this is somebody else. Could be the music. Um, open up the door to, uh, to your guides, communication, but this also could be to love opening up your heart space again. Yeah, you could have been very untrusting because things have happened to you. I never needed anybody's help in any way. It's almost like you could have shut yourself off. Being recluse, you could be a little bit down. Now remember, you must go and get professional advice if you've got um, anything like that. You're feeling down, talk to somebody, anybody. Sorry, it's just so hard outside. There's nobody there. Um, okay, because I'm not a professional in those fields uh you need to um go and get some, you know talk to somebody professional you've got angels all around you communication um being sent healing you are communicating with the angelic realm 24 may be important to you there could be somebody coming from the angelic realm this could be past loved one ancestors other angels could be bringing them to communicate with you a message honestly all i get is angela Everything I do, Angela, Joanne, and Janice, I'd, and a Bill and a Trevor. I just get them constantly. Um, somebody's been asked to look at their own power, to remember who they are, to remember what they came here to do. And it goes with a reflection, not to let people put you down and make you feel small. You are not small. This is also something from the past, a dinosaur that you need to let go of, transform. A dinosaur may have power, as in somebody who thinks old ways, who can't see the word for the trees, who's locked in the past. Uh, you might be called to enlighten them. Yeah, deliberation. You deliberate on something. Okay, you need to get on with it. Something to do with the music composing. I'm seeing a travel clap. I'm seeing writing. And I've seen John Lennon again. Planning. You may need to plan more. It's all a bit, it's just coming out as you're doing it. And I get that because that's how it does, works for me. Writing, you'd be channeling music, but channeling from your higher self. Um, you've been asked to plan a little bit more and not so much at midnight, but there's something about midnight caller, DG. Getting a call at midnight is very important. This could be a crime call. It's like Crime Stoppers, something like that. I, I don't know, but there's an important call. This could be a perpetrator, somebody committing crimes in the area. There's an important call at midnight and you will be on air. Oh. Three, transformation. Allow the magic of who you are to be seen by the eyes you keep. You keep. You are enough, my dear. Take ease and receiving somebody's not believing in themselves and they've stopped doing whatever it is creativity um and hiding because i i don't know if somebody said something to you or you've had bad reviews you've got to pick yourself up and get on again because look at all this growth that's 
I'm told it's coming in, but you have growth already that did really well and you've got to keep building on it. Don't let them put you down. Dark days of winter. I must seek to befriend the hidden parts of the self, the darkness that embraces the whole of who I am. Who or what have you put on ice? Because we've got something you've put on ice, you need to get going with again. Okay? Dance with it. Okay? Peppermint. Take from me what keeps me held back, clearing myself from all that does not belong in the vision of what is to come. You've got to see yourself for who you really are, your talent. Somebody has put you down. Trickster energy because they are in competition with you. Do not allow them to do this. Okay? Flight. Don't run away from it. You're being led. You'll be led back onto the path. Okay, what else? Can we go the tarot now? Or? Well, we would if we could. I've just realised I haven't got any tarot. Oh, no, I have. That's a lie. That's a lie. Somebody lying to you? Or you, you're very aware of it? We're finding out a lie. This could be midnight. I'm getting this card game. There is something happening at midnight. Tonight. And it's a Friday. So it doesn't matter if uh, you're watching this two years later. It could be the Friday that's coming. Okay. So we have some, there's definitely some deceit. Somebody's been keeping some news from you, some knowledge. Divination. Somebody's been finding... 14, something out about you. Somebody's been having a reading on you. They want to know more about you, but it's locked down. A spirit, Knight of Pentacles, something coming in very slow. You may be doing some divination. You may be starting your own tower business. It's slow um, building, but it's coming. Um, but there's some deceit here that's been hidden from you. There's something hidden from you. Somebody is finding out information about you. The number 14 may be relevant. They want to know about your path, who you are, what you're doing. You may be um, putting yourself out there spiritually. Something to do with music. I keep getting this card. It's something to do with your music. Gravity. Somebody trying to pull you down so they can fly above you. Trying to keep you in your south node, you need to go north. They want to be ahead of you. You're going to shine in the stars. Expansion. It's expansion. You're getting over the obstacles. The right people that will be coming in. You will be getting an agent. Why are these three cards over here? Four cards. Why are they over there? I didn't pick them out. So fallen. Are they relevant? put them back this one is um strength you need strength you have to believe in yourself to keep back the competition you can do it you can get ahead okay the hermit you are being guided it's almost like you have to go away for a little bit to um write this um because we've got i would call this card i mean it says flight but it's the light for the hermit excuse me <coughs> excuse me a path being illuminated you may have a call somebody may have flu and they're still writing and doing stuff you're being shown something something is being illuminated it could be in a dream could be at midnight in a call a secret um unveiled something hidden Coming to light a rejection a rejection that was unfounded i don't know if somebody's rejected you for something and then they decided to come back for work it could be for work it could be for um but something you thought was gone is returning uh something you were rejected it was a rejection You have to juggle with whatever you've chosen now. 
I mean, look at this. It looks like a complete shock, doesn't it? This light. But whatever it is, you'll now have to juggle because you chose something else. But something you thought had gone is coming back around. I'm getting that song. Nothing stays the same. Coming around again. Carly Simon. You may play that song. I'm seeing it on turntable. Something going around. The, the cycle could be... Um, no, it's something returning to you. Revolving. Revolving doors. Partridge. Keep getting partridge. Four of cups, an offer that you're not sure to take. I'm going to have to do a lot of thinking about it. There is definitely, there would be some juggling here. Queen of Swords. You may be having words. Why did you reject me the first time? This could be a lover. This could be a husband coming back or a wife. Nothing stays the same. Eight of Cups. And you may be walking away from this. You may need to. If the offer's not right. Whether it's for work or love. Queen of Cups. I mean, look at these rings here. Could join. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, somebody's getting back together. Um, or you could be joining with... Oh, this is somebody new. This is a family. This is everything you want. Ten of Cups. Happiness. You... Oh, this could be an... Is this... An ex returning, telling you they still love you and they were a fool, but you're already getting married. Now, showing me the Vicar Dibley, she was actually getting married and the night before, everybody who'd liked her, all, all the men, it's a comedy programme in the UK, the first uh, English female English vicar we had, ran from 99, was it? Or 98 to 2000 and odd, we in the... It was massive and I love it, absolutely love it. And that night before she gets married, she was getting married to Richard Armitage. Ooh. Um, they all came and knocked on her door and asked them to marry her. And I don't know if that's what's happening. This could be the eve of your wedding. Don't be tempted. You know where the truth lies could have been kept from you for a long time or you could be getting a call at midnight i love you drunken call it's definitely an invitation but four of wands it's also about a wedding a primary celebration and a first celebration um, to growth some offers coming in this is also an offer some offer, contract, something's coming in that was unexpected and it's going to cause massive growth. You are going to get accepted. You are all going to accept it and it's going to bring in everything you want. Something about midnight tonight. Midnight Australia. In particular. Could be anywhere. But midnight Australia. Australia. Nothing stays the same. It's coming around again. I can't even, I, I just hear those words. Carly Simon's song. Two of swords. Two minds about something. Not seeing which way to go. Four of pentacles. Stability. I'm trying to get stability. Nine of wands. This, um, not knowing which way to go to get stability is causing a lot of burdens. Taking on extra things that you sh you don't need to. Yeah. Eight of wands. A lot of messages. Offers coming in. Unexpected. This, I have to keep saying, is this going to make you a star? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> God, <that was laughs> We're going to make you a star. Uh -huh. I love that song. Um, David Essex. It's playing loudly in my head. There's something about you becoming a star. It could be for this music. It could be anything. 
we're, we're going to make it stop. This could be from an agent. There's definitely, um, it's an offer you haven't even, it's unexpected offer and you're unsure of it at first, but I'm getting, it's an institution. I heard Philharmonic Orchestra as well for somebody. Um, London Philharmonic. Um, Four of Pentacles, Nine of One. There's burdens. This, you were going to walk away from it because it was causing so many burdens and you weren't getting the stability you wanted. But it's coming in for you. Look at all these messages. You've impressed somebody somewhere. Angela again. Ten of Swords. The end of pain and misery. A new day begins. Nothing stays. It's a new journey. Oh, oh, he's covered. A new journey. Oh, God, look at this. Money, money, money. Oh, it's sunny. <laughs> In a rich person's world. <laughs> is your six of one. Oh my god this is my favorite card this is also public recognition we're gonna make you a star it's playing really loudly in my head <laughs> the music oh my god i mean i was i wasn't old enough i wasn't allowed to watch the movie but i watched it later it was from a movie what was it we're gonna make you a star i can't remember but that was the big song for me he was huge at the time david essex yeah and very, very popular and on social media. Um, definitely something about music. Is that anything you can confirm what else this is about? Eight of Wands messages. Oh, look, we've got music there again. Look, there's confirmation. I'm seeing John Lennon. Is there anything else this is for? Nothing. All right, you know what they're showing me? Oh, that bit where you get everything. Oh, my goodness. The movie Flashdance. This will be important to somebody out there. It's important to me as well because Flashdance, the movie, the best, well, it's not the best bit at the end. The whole movie's fantastic. Um, first when there's nothing, um, that song. But I'm not really getting the song. What I'm getting is the bit at the end where she goes to, spoiler alert, by the way, because this is the end, where she goes to the ballet school. She gets in. She comes out. The boss's son is waiting for her with all the money. Where he's posh, with his gorgeous dog. And here's the rose. So she gets the man. She gets a dream, a big dream that she's fought for, everything. She's a star. She's everything, it all. Neat package. <laughs> what everybody should aspire to uh, uh, as a metaphor to get everything she gets everything the man she loves the everything so that is what's coming around again it's it's coming back around something you thought was lost is coming back around can we find out if it's for more than music these 10 things i'm getting so let's see what else emotions it could be love, refinement, how to for stability, a job that's coming in, regeneration of a path, a creative path, focus, getting focused back, everything, stuff and grounding. So you need to focus and ground. There's something about midnight, midnight caller. Duality. There could be two things here that you're, two things that you're having to juggle. Is that upside down? Yes, but they want it straight. So, it is what you are very passionate about. Right. Let's get a couple of these and let's uh, end it there. My chair's too low. Oh. Oh well, it's definitely. Oh, so somebody, oh my God, look at this. Um, they just ticked out. Do I, must I take them all? Right, we've got the angel. You've had to clear quite a few things. Um, some hurts, some pain, some um, not feeling confident, grudges, whatever it is. And you've been going through that. Uh, 
we've got friendship. There may be somebody uh, that's helped you. There's also a friendship that's turned into a love match here. Uh, we've got Angel of Patience. You've had to have a lot of patience. But whoever's had this patience, yes, the wish is yours, little boy. Angus. Okay. 20 weeks time. Or you are 20 weeks. I don't know, but somebody better check. <laughs> um, and here you go. Romance is yours. The angels are bringing in romance. So there's quite a few things, really. Somebody's gifts are coming online. Claire Sentience here. We've got two of wands. Somebody's got two things. I don't know which way to go. You will do. Whatever you are most passionate about, Ace of Cups, a gift of emotion. Somebody's saying sorry as well. Oh, isn't it nice when we get nice stuff? <laughs> Somebody coming in with a proposal here, Knight of Cups. Conflict. A proposal that causes conflict a bit here. Being guided. Quite a lot about being guided. You are being guided. A proposal that didn't work caused a lot of conflict. Now you're being guided. Um, this could have been a work proposal that didn't work, but look, you are getting your building. End of a cycle, a painful cycle. Now you can do what you want. Every, you've learnt, learned whatever it is you needed to learn for that particular cycle. You are the magician. You can build this. You can work it. There's a monetary gift coming in here. Reject all that is past and all how you did this the first time because you need strategy. We've got the King of Pentacles, a new strategy. You're gonna, because there's big change. A, and for somebody else, that's right, a, this is a different message, yes? Right, for a big change, somebody has to make a sacrifice. There's been a big change and you've put it, been put in the hangman position. So you need to make a sacrifice. Six of Cups, something from the past didn't come back because that was actually turned that way. King of Cups, negotiation, something... I would say this is the negotiator, the peacekeeper. There wasn't any peace. Or you had to walk away from something. Um, change your strategy. Bring in a change. For some of you. You're getting your wish now. You're going to be a star. This is not just about following the star. You're going to be a star. This is what you've wanted all your life. 33, 13 on the clock. You could be, something could be going viral here for you. King of Pentacles. Your new strategy is working. Keep at it. Oh, can you stop with the lights? Full speed ahead. There's quite a few of you getting a lot of success. And I want to leave it on that. Yeah. Those seeds that you planted are now bearing fruit and are illuminated for all to see. Okay, keep going. Good luck. That's fantastic. Last, something positive. All right, take care of yourselves. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't already. Please check out the World Predictions uh, videos. I did a bit of an emotional one yesterday. Um, I got a very strange download uh, about somebody trapped somewhere. So, uh you might want to check that one out. And I'm doing a new one tonight. I speak my truth, shall we say, on, the, on that one. And, um, <coughs> excuse me. So it's worth a watch, actually. But the one tonight as well, it's going out at eight o'clock. So this will be earlier. Uh, please check. Yeah, I was detoxifying myself. Yes, that's right. <laughs> I put a light on that. So, yeah, please do that. You've got until midnight, midnight tonight to, um, Contact me if you want a reading um, in November. And then I'm closing my readings. So, yeah, uh, you can become a Patreon member. I've got some stuff on there. And it, 
um, few videos on there. Uh, please check out my spicy romance I co-created with Spirit on Inca as well. A lot of it's for free, so check that out. Um, and yeah, good luck. Have a great weekend. Take care of yourselves. I shall see you next time. Thanks. Bye.